Hey YouTube, it's Diane. I know it's been a long time since I've done a video. Um, I don't have my sticky note with me, but I have a huge list of things that um, I need to share with you all, or that I will share with you all. First things first, um, work. I've just been decorating my classroom, just finishing out the school year. I've had a ton of drama this year. I'm never going to get into it. Just know it was dramatic and that I'm over it at this point. I'm just ready for a break and ready for something different. It's been a challenging year, but it's still been very rewarding. I can still say that. So first things first with that. Um, I have updated my classroom a little bit. I've done some decorating, so I'll probably do a separate vlog before I take everything down for EOG to show you how the room looks. Um, next thing. That's about it for the classroom, really. Um, this past Wednesday, so April 27th, I went to Arizona. First time on a plane, I know. <laughs> but um, I was there from Sunday to, no, no, Wednesday to Sunday. So the 27th of April to the 1st of May, and I had a great time. Greg and I just saw each other for the first time since January 3rd or 4th, or, I think it was January 3rd. And we just cuddled a lot. And <laughs> such a dory. It went to Tombstone. We just did some shopping and everything and that was pretty fun. Um, I did take a little bit of footage so I'll probably do that in a separate video. Not very much of it really. But um, the climate was just so different. I was so dry. Oh my god he didn't warn me. He said he didn't tell me how dry it was because he was afraid I wouldn't come because he knows how like my hair is getting to be moisturized. So that's another story. <laughs> but um, <laughs> that's that. Um, so I'll probably just do a separate video about that. Um, in terms of Arizona and what's going to happen with that. Well we'll get married June 18th. And we're going to the honeymoon, which is a totally different video because we're still talking about all the details of that. But then I'm just going to um, get a U-Haul with Greg. We're just going to haul my stuff on over there after the honeymoon. So I'll be in Arizona late June, early July. So I'll keep you all updated on that. Not going to tell you where, just know it's Arizona. And he's stationed there. So I probably gave it away. I mean, basically in Arizona. I don't know. <laughs> I probably gave it away. But yeah, we're getting married June 18th. I'll show you the invite. I actually got these invitations from Walmart. Because <laughs> I wasn't going to do anything too fancy. I think they came out pretty nice. Um, I'm just going to show you the top portion. Um, I'm not going to show you where it is because I don't need any crazy people coming to our wedding. I'm going to have enough crazy people there. But um, that's just the top of the invitation, what it looks like. So it's just you are cordially invited to celebrate the wedding of Zaya Bella Hill and Wiley Greg Bullock Jr. on Saturday, June 8th, our wedding invitation. I think it turned out pretty nice considering I dragged butt on a lot of stuff. But um, at least people know where to go. And I actually had enough room to fit all the directions too, which was good. I didn't have to have a separate car for that. So we will have a beachfront ceremony. Marble Beach, South Carolina. That could be anywhere, so I'm not worried about people stalking me there. And um, it's going to be about 30 to 50 people. Thing is, I over invited, of course. Um, I'm thinking 30 to 50 people. We kind of want a quaint ceremony, nothing too dramatic. We're not even doing like a traditional reception. We're going to do like a what I call wedding luncheon, so that should be pretty nice. It's at our favorite oceanfront restaurant, so that should be pretty nice. And then we'll just cruise on to the honeymoon, so that should be really nice. Um, anything else? I think that's about it. Now, in terms of the hair, I will insert a video or a picture at the end of this video about my hair, but I mean, that's really it. I've just been pinning it up trying to do some it needs to be washed and washing it tonight but um i just really been pinning it up and doing some protective styles and when i went to arizona i did wear it out and i probably shouldn't have because it was so dry and i didn't have near the amount of stuff i needed to take care of it but um i wore it out last week for the first time in a long time but um as the weather gets warmer i'll definitely do that and as i move to arizona i'll figure out what works for my hair and kind of tweak my regimen a little bit but um, what I will do is do a hair update and I'll show you the products I'm using, some of the styles I've been trying, and I'll be doing that pretty soon. It's just been hectic trying to finish up school. Why keep saying school like I'm like I haven't graduated? Trying to finish up working at the school and trying to get all the wedding stuff in order. And not only that, I mean I just got a job last year and I have to find another job, so I have to update my resume again, get recommendations, apply, and all that other stuff which is on my brain. And I'm trying to sell this my apartment, so I have a lot of stuff going on right now. And YouTube, I watch videos all the time, but I just haven't had a time to post. But I'm glad I've had this chance to do so. Once again, that's the wedding invitation. I'll keep you all updated on the going on of the wedding. I will give you all pictures and show you all how everything turns out. Um, I would show my video, or my video, my goodness, my wedding dress. I would do a video of my dress and how it looks, but I'll just probably surprise you all with photos, so don't worry about that. Um, I don't think there's anything else. Everything for the wedding is pretty set. Um, the only thing left is to like pay the money for the violinist, which is what we're going to have as I come down the aisle and stuff. But other than that, I mean, it's just putting down deposits on stuff and, oh, Greg's ring. Now, we went this past um, weekend to, what is it, 
what is that place? Chandler Fashion Center or something. It's like a mall in um, Chandler, Arizona, which is right near Phoenix. We went there um, to find a ring, and we found a pretty nice one at Hellsburg, I think it was. But they weren't trying to talk the price down, and we were like, heck no, they have that same darn ring online at Reed, and it's a lot cheaper. And the lady was like, yeah, it's a um, so-and-so piece. We can't give it to you cheaper. So we were like, whatever. So what we're going to do is a few days before the wedding, when Greg gets to um, North Carolina, we're just going to go to Reed, because he wears like a size 10, I think, so he has like the average middle finger. We're going to go to Reed and just pick up the, um, the ring we want. So that's that. I think that's everything. Um, looking at my little list here. I'll just keep y'all updated. I promise to try to do more videos and do them more frequently, but I always say that. I never keep my promises, but we'll see. But, yeah, that's everything. So, thank you all for watching. I've had a ton of new subscribers. I haven't made a video since January, but hey to all the new I know it's been a long time. Hey to all the subbies, and there's more to come. Oh, and I forgot one more thing, one more update. The braces. Um, my doctor is waiting for my bite to align. I think that's the only thing that's um, left. I should have had these things off a while ago. I've had them off for like two and a half years, I think. Are you trying to show braces? Yeah. Don't. <laughs> the thing is, I want to have these off by the wedding, but what he was saying was, if my bite isn't aligned, what he might do is take off the top row. So when I smile, you won't be able to see as much of the um, metal. But um, the goal is to have these off before my wedding. Let's pray about it. Um, so that's the update there. Oh, who's my nephew? Kane. I'm sure a lot of you may already know him. Edie Hill, son. Mm. But, alright. Uh, <laughs> okay. But hey, Jinx Here's Kane. Um, yeah, I'm over here at Emerald tonight. I typically come every single weekend. Well, I've been here every weekend since like January 3rd, honestly, since Greg left. And this, my trip to Arizona was the first weekend in a long time I haven't come here. But it's a Monday, and usually Mondays, I'm like, well, I might as well go 